take that to the way you can. But it will do Canada people out. Mm-hmm. You know, that's, you know, so uh, it's like, you know, you being open and being free. Okay. Because, like, you know, recording, recording those songs, the clip songs, There you go. That, that's what you're getting. Uh, and they say, hey, you need to do this, you need to do that, you need to do this. You know, and they say, you're the artist, you know, uh, you come in here, you know, don't, you know, you know, I'm here to help you. That's right. So, you know. So, what do you say about an artist? Because, like, you look at American Idol. You know, the artist that wants to sing so badly, but they can't. Well, see, you know, I, I, I really don't watch American Idol. Me either. Uh, <laughs> uh, you know, and, and, and most of the time, it's because my kids have taken me so far off the and, uh, and, and I'm the type of person, I'm like, hey, I'm a lot of money for my time. Mm-hmm. And, 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 you know, if you get a chance to do something, if that's your way, that's your, your book, if that's your train, if that's your train, mm-hmm. and, and, and you get a chance to go on American Idol, uh, 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 you know, so you got my blessing. But that's not me. Mm-hmm. So that, that's all I got to say about it. That's why that's how I look at it. People that can do what you do, make music. But what I'm trying to say is when you were saying to waste your time when producers say that, at some point, because you really have a good voice, and did you ever have voice lessons or...
Look at you. Why? Because you really do have a good, you're clear and you're on key. You know, and that's the problem with some artists. They don't, it's like, for me, I have, which is a New Orleans kid. Everybody would know eventually when I, because as an, he's an artist as well, as well as a DJ. He has a couple of songs you hear in his rotation now. Why? And they meet me down in New Orleans because he's from New Orleans. You know, they love the song because it's so earthy, just like yours. I mean, your voice is right there. It's very good voice. It's like you should be on the radio. You should never, never be on the radio. But then you have these artists that just like, you know, I, I know the effort, and I, and I always say that. Even right now, me with speaking, you know, being a DJ, you have to be a, you know, it comes, like you say, it comes with the territory, the love of it. But at the same time, you have to improve some kind of way. At, at some point, where people want to listen to you and your voice, I got to your, your voice, I was like, you sound very well. Very, I mean, it's, I, I listen to everything. I know the music is there. Very good producers. But then your voices just fit. They, you can really, really sing. And you're not trying to be fancy. You're not trying to, it's not like you're trying to show competition. Although you can be competition. It's, 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 it's good. It's good stuff. <laughs> and see, you know what? And a lot of people they don't they don't understand that he's something home. I'm, I'm I'm gonna be that star no matter what. And sometimes like I used to hate, I used to I, mean, I went to Columbia College and I had my of course my my our, my friend he's my he's he's my publicist he's everything and he's one of our he's, he has a record company called Home to Dome and he's one of the, one of the prolific so, I mean voice person ever. He taught me he challenged me actually to do, you know, the Shaka Khans, you know, to get more soul to my voices. You know, every girl can do, and not every girl, but every girl that's singer, their insp inspiration is Whitney Houston, which is good, but he always told me, well, can you get some soul, a little bit more soul? And I, I, he always taught me that to be your best, you have to sound your best. You have to look your best and present your best. You know, and I was blown away when I, I was like, yes, this is no jive. When I first got the I opened up the package to that song, and uh -huh. I was so nervous. And it took me a while. I know you was like, they ain't going to never get back to me. They ain't going to never put my song in rotation. No, it was a time, okay, and I wanted to be your, this is your time. I wanted to give you a promise. When you, when you put out good effort, you want to put that out the right way. Because that's what we took a little bit of time to actually put your song in rotation, give you a proper interview, let your fans know how, you know, just how loved you are, you know? And amazing, you know, I the responses. They yeah, put yeah. your song in rotation, it's like, show, boom, 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 my phones blow up and, you know, you and, you know, I mean, you play like five, six, seven times <laughs> in a day. Yeah, you know, and because people like good music, they don't like you know they don't like just a blow off. Okay. And uh, I mean you say that you know, you, you know I, I want you know artists need to hear okay. that it's not a joke it's not just putting the mic in your hand and saying look mommy I'm on TV. It's it's it's, it's okay. something that you would do for the rest of your life something you love to do, and it has to come from a true artist. Okay. It's not you're not making him them feel different or separate from you, but at the same time. You know, you work and you love what you do. And that's what I uh, point you get across, you know, being in Chicago Pierre and the, a part of our radio station, which is WTPS, we represent the best. And you are one of those. Wow. Yeah. So, so, so and I'm glad you mentioned that about that being the best because producers will sing you home. They don't want they don't want you to, to sing their music. They don't want you to be a part of their project if you can comply. And that's all about complying. You know. And you, you, a lot of people that join American Idol, they don't have that confidence yet, I think. <laughs> they need someone to tell them, I can sing at least. And then all of a sudden, can I get a song and, you know, and where can I go next from here and here to here? But you're right. You, you're an artist that, you're an artist that belongs. And keep going. We're going to.